Hello and welcome back to Crash Bandicoot 2 with your story Lord of Andrew the Mad. Hi Lord, the first is Harmony, just sweeping and the two boxes Madman. Give this like this is 13 and all around Hunter guy. Now we have two types of, three types of levels here. We have this type, which is uh, lots of pistons and stuff. Kind of reminiscent of this environment here. Then we have this type, which is basically just darkness again. I think I'm gonna do that first. And then we have uh, jetpacks. With uh, rocket and uh, back attack, and yeah, space attack is the same as piston. It. Let's go to the darkness first. I have done totally fly. I'm not afraid of the dark, not anymore. No. It doesn't make the level any less difficult though. Whether or not I am or I'm not afraid of the dark. This is still troublesome once I accidentally lose my light, such as then. Not too problematic in this particular scenario though. Not yet anyway. Seriously? Alright. Please tell me this side has no boxes. Otherwise, I will be most displeased. Yeah, it seems to be without boxes. Good. Very good. I think this is the first time where a split actually has left us without boxes. I'm just gonna see how far this goes. Maybe there's a life or something. A stray object. No, there are boxes. There were in fact two boxes. Oh, god damn it. Ah, but those are approachable from this direction. Good. Good to know. Research. Plus a gem gathered. Excellent. Uh, now let's go this way. And uh, deal with the situation proper. Uh, bye. What? What was... I... Alright, remember how... Maybe someone has read the comment, maybe someone has not. But I said on one video that uh, I don't really recall a lot of bugs from my childhood. i sure that never happened to me then. Now that makes more sense. Okay, let's try it again this time without failing horribly. Sounds like a plan. After I do this level, I intend to do uh, rocket. God damn it. Now I'm gonna be left in the dark. Alternatively, I may just get myself killed again. The game has blessed me with a Uga Baka, so I can just do this and call it a day. Let's carry on. God damn, there's a lot of stuff here. Which I would rather not poke with my nose thing. Good. Get that checkpoint and keep on running. Don't stop crash. Never stop crash. Just run crash. Just run forever into a hole. I don't remember if there was much more I had to collect with that. Not by the look of it. God damn it. That's why we'll find big pets. Right, let's carry on. Doesn't at all appear to be a case of needing to actually go on without the light. Except I did that a little bit anyway because I wanted to be sure. 
gehouden. Wat de hel? Dit is... Wat is het weer? No idea how I'm supposed to do that. Okay. Oh, that's how. Alright. Keep going. Just didn't need to let go of the key. And out we go. I hope there weren't any boxes on the final platform because I wasn't really checking. Which hopefully will not cause any trouble at all. Any luck, that might actually be the case. Alright. Jump. Jump. Get these two boxes and... Go. Good thing our scouting run was successful in that regard. Otherwise we may have had to fumble around in the dark, not knowing where those two boxes were. Because usually I'm quite sated with just getting the gem and getting the hell out of there. Good thing that this time that was not what I did. Anyway, we got the gem. Well, we got both the gems. Both. And the crystal. We got everything. And once we have everything, which is now, we can sip some tea. And once I have this tea, which I have, I'm gonna skip the cheek and go to back attack. Back attack is magic gibberish for uh, Counter Strike, by the way. And off we go. You can fly. Oh, all right. This is how that worked. Yeah. This is not a, a very easy map type, though it isn't the most difficult because it doesn't really entail a lot of uh, extra areas or anything like that. It's just, you know, kind of different to control. For example, the key I used to use to jump now progresses me and the key I used to use to crouch now takes me backwards. Yep. Alright, oh, we have our first checkpoint over there. Can I access it? Yes. But there's also a box. I almost missed that one. Oh, and a friend. The point of this friend is that uh, he sets off the trap. Yay. Look at all the writers. Oh god, this would be damned. Can I just rush it? Or do it! Oh. Remember kids, don't push your balls against uh, live wires. That may help. any boxes but if I do I'm going to just do the other level problem. I keep trying to ascend with X but that's not what it does. Oh well. It's actually a matter of ascending with the king stick thingy. Ah. I'm not good with this at all. Right, you keep going. All right, uh, now 
go. Could have gone worse, could have gone better. But, uh, well, doing better in that context just means could have gone more according to. Oh, perfection. Come on, don't get stuck on that. Tell me you're not stuck on that. Crash. It's just that the stick is inverted, so I was moving the wrong way. Alright, keep nudging you forward. That's a lot of nitrous here. I wonder who they were trying to make laugh. Please. Alright. Are you stuck on something? Crash. Maybe you're not supposed to get stuck on things. Alright, and that concludes uh, back attack, from which we got all the gems, which was one gem and one crystal. All in all, a successful mission. And on that note, thank you for watching, I'll see you next time, yay! Next time on Crash Bandicoot 2. Alright, back on the raid ride, which means... Back here. Of course, I lost the mask on the way, so maybe it was useful. God damn it. I'm a big silly. Except now I'm really tiny.